Rosalind Wyman, the youngest person ever elected to the Los Angeles City Council, at age 22 in 1953, was best known for keeping an unusual campaign promise, vowing to bring Major League Baseball to Los Angeles. It took months of negotiations with the Dodgers mercurial owner, Walter O'Malley, before he finally agreed to uproot the team from Brooklyn and head to L. A, the opening chapter in what would become the westward migration of professional sports teams. Without Rosalind Wyman, the Dodgers would. A California political insider and power broker for more than a half century and only the second woman elected to the city council, Wyman died late Wednesday at her home in Bel Air, her family said in a statement. She was 92. Roz was a force of nature, breaking down barriers for women in California politics, while forging new ways to bring people together through politics, the arts, and baseball, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi said in a statement. Her leadership helped draw her beloved Dodgers to Los Angeles, and my Giants to San Francisco, so that California families could experience the thrill of America's pastime. Diane Feinstein recalled meeting Wyman when she was the mayor of San Francisco and the young councilwoman was hard at work stumping for Robert Kennedy, then a rising presidential candidate who was assassinated in L. A. after winning the California primary in 1968. Wyman would go on to co-chair Feinstein's Senate campaign. Of course if there was one thing Roz was more passionate about than democratic politics, it was her hometown of Los Angeles and her beloved Dodgers, Feinstein said in a statement. Wyman served on the council for a dozen years, and almost from the start had the Dodgers on her mind. I wanted Al. To be major league in everything, the arts, music and sports, Wyman told Los Angeles Magazine in 2010. I put in a resolution saying we should try to bring in a big league team. When she and another council member wrote to then Dodger President O'Malley, Peter's father, Seeking an appointment in 1955 to discuss bringing the team west from Brooklyn, he curtly turned them down. He wrote back that he was a New Yorker and he preferred to stay in New York, Wyman said.